So, CO2 canister. This right here is your regulator, sir. Mm -hmm. So you go ahead and you hook your regulator up to your CO2 canister. You just go ahead and put it on there. You go ahead and hand tighten it okay. until it seems tight. If you put it on there and by hand tightening, you still hear that mm -hmm. spray, then get a wrench. Get a and go ahead and tighten it down until you do not hear anything, so you're not leaking any gas. Okay. This, this bad boy regulates everything, so you don't need to worry about uh, anything other than making sure the valve is on. Okay. Uh, I don't know which is on or off. I think that's off and that's on, um, okay. but you'll figure it out, obviously. Okay. Uh, attached to your keg, mm -hmm. these guys have the loops. I think if you know, uh, you'll find the notches. You put it in, yep. turn it, and then make sure you, uh, I don't think it's already down, and then make sure you notch that bad boy down so it's sealed. Okay, notch that down until it's sealed. Okay, yep. so after, crank after it in and notch it down. Crank it, it in, notch it down. Okay. Um, and then you can put some ice, and ice water in there so it'll continue to chill your beer as it comes through yep. the line. Blah, 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 on, on. And I, as a, it's okay to put salt in the water. No good problem. to go. Then it'll chill it down further. Yeah, okay, man. mind if I put this on YouTube? I don't care. All right. Go for good. it. <laughs> Thank you. All right, hell yeah. Hell yeah.